Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little cook with me slash eat with me. It's gonna be a nice, pretty healthy recipe so you guys can get some inspiration from this. I've never done something like this where it's just like a cooking. I feel like I'm on like the Food Network or something. Except I'm really bad at cooking. I got ready to film this video in like 30 seconds because I want to eat. Everyone always asks me where this top is from and it's from Urban Outfitters. I got it a little while ago, but if I can still find it, online i'll leave it linked down below i'm trying to get this like a real cooking show you guys i have my vlog camera right here i want this to be like my debut cooking show okay maybe besides like what i eat in a days this will probably be the last time you guys see this kitchen i get the keys to my new place in two weeks oh no three weeks three weeks have i talked about my new place in overwhelmingly large amount yes am i gonna still talk about it all the time yes you guys are probably bored of me first thing i need to do right now is make myself a cup of coffee i already had one cup but oh you know, I was trying to get a cute shot, and these pans are just so dirty. I made pasta the other day, and the water boiled over. <laughs> all of the pasta water got all over the stove. Instead of cleaning it up, what I thought about doing was just leaving it until my boyfriend gets so aggravated with it that he cleans it. Okay, back to the coffee. Does anybody else leave all their cake cups in there after you use it instead of, like, throwing them out? Because same. Wait a second this changes everything guys i didn't even know that there were arrows on this this one holds a lot coffee's prepared i'm ready to roll in today's video i'm actually working with my favorites again let me go get it <laughs> dun, 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 dun. oh you can't even see it hello fresh yay can you see it it's HelloFresh. You guys know how much I love HelloFresh. I've worked with them in the past on so many videos and I just like them because they help me step out of my comfort zone and try new recipes that I normally wouldn't try and just like different ideas because I get really lazy in the kitchen. And plus it also helps with cooking time. It makes it so much more convenient and just quicker and easier. If you guys don't know what HelloFresh is, they're basically like a meal kit delivery service. So I took out all three of these bags. Here's two of them right here but yeah they just come in little bags like this i honestly don't know what meal i want to make today because they all sound so good by the way all of these meals they only take around 30 minutes to make because they're all already pre-portioned out they give you all the ingredients like exactly how you need them to be which is great because i also waste so much food i buy too much portions for one person it's really difficult to shop for that many people these are the three recipes that i got so we have mediterranean baked veggies that looks bomb heirloom tomato flatbreads this one might be the one i make and then lastly we got the cheese crusted quesadillas y'all i'm gonna be a good girlfriend and save that one for a night with us too so today for my lunch i'm gonna make the heirloom tomato flatbread it's gonna be different but we're gonna do it okay okay cheers <laughs> y'all my phone just went off and the only time my phone ever goes off anymore is when fab is texting me or my mom is texting me anyways here's the bag of the heirloom tomato flatbreads yes this is an overview of everything that we got in this bag so i love how simple all the ingredients are like this is all we need to make the recipe i love it also i think we all just need to take a moment for how freaking cute this balsamic vinaigrette is like they really do not waste you guys this is so tiny i want to keep the bottle after am i weird on the back of all of these cards they have everything that you have to do with pictures so yeah i'm just gonna follow these directions and hope for the best on a real note here i feel like whenever any recipe has this fresh mozzarella in it it's just like a game changer. This is the part that I'm a little bit skeptical of, the walnuts. I like walnuts, I've just never had them on a pizza before. We moved over to my stove. Now this recipe actually makes two, not one, but since it's just me home right now, I'm just gonna make this one. This is literally the easiest recipe I have ever done. The pesto has been evenly spread out and now I just get to add on the toppings so you don't have the walnuts on right now. You just add the mozzarella. I don't know how many to do. That looks nice. It's really fun. <laughs> Tomatoes on pizza is one of my favorite things. I think I did a pretty good job decorating it. I'm just saying. While the pizza is cooking, it says to find a bowl. 
check. So it says to do one tablespoon of this. There we go. Mixed with, it says a large drizzle of olive oil. So I'm just gonna do like half of this, maybe a little bit more. And then they used a whisk, but since I am only 21 years old and living on my own, I don't own a whisk. I'm just gonna add like half of the arugula in. I have learned, you guys, over the years to love arugula. Cause I feel like it's on a lot of things. There's one thing I did want to talk about really quickly. You guys know how I mentioned that everything that you get is pre-portioned out. And the thing that I like the most about that is you don't have to go to the grocery store and buy like that random ingredient. You know, like that thing that you see on a recipe on Pinterest or something and you're like, where would I ever find that? And that's just a waste of money because you'll probably never use that ingredient again in another recipe. So the pre-portioned out thing is great because you just use it once and you're done with it. So like for me, the um, vinaigrettes, like if they gave me a huge bottle of that or if I had to go out and buy a huge bottle of that, I don't know when I would use it again. They just do all the work for you. They make it super simple and easy and cooking is just a breeze. Like you guys saw, this was literally six steps and they were all foolproof. Like there is no way you could mess up this recipe. I'm just waiting here for the oven to preheat. So yeah, it's only 15 away. And then we can finally put the pizza in and I can almost eat. Okay, bye. Love you, be safe. Okay, she is done. She is looking beautiful. All we have to do to finish this off is add the arugula. I'm just gonna use my washed hands. And then also, just have to add the chopped walnuts. I just feel very professional whenever I use this pizza cutter. My name's Trisha Paytas, and this is my mukbang, or mukbang. <laughs> How does Trisha say? <laughs> okay, no, seriously, I do feel like Trisha right now because I've never like eaten on camera like this before, like fully eaten on camera. Anyways, here's the pizza. I don't wanna tip it too far because like, I can foresee this falling over and you know. All I'm gonna say you guys, I have not tasted it yet, but it smells, it looks, and I'm sure it tastes like something just like from a restaurant. Like I feel like I'm at Earth Cafe in LA. If you guys wanna try out HelloFresh for yourselves, you can use my discount code MOLLYB60 and that's gonna get you $60 off your first three boxes, so $20 off each box. I will leave all that information down below in the description box if you didn't pay attention to anything I just said. So make sure to go check that out and visit HelloFresh. The link will be right down below. Do I need a thumbnail like this? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god. I know that y'all are probably not gonna believe me, but I feel blessed to eat this food right now. How do people do these? I'm just eating the whole time. <laughs> um, huh. I guess I can also show you guys some of my favorite songs right now. I guess we'll listen to them for a second because I don't want to get copyrighted. This song I was listening to before I filmed this video and it is so good. I just saw it. It was on my daily mix thing on Spotify. I don't know. I don't really reach out so first. Young Thug came out with a new album. Let me pause this. But he came out with a new album, so of course I had to listen to it, and I did like a couple of the songs. It's called January 1st, so let me see. This is the Young Thug I like. It takes me like 70 listens to figure out what exactly he's saying. Did you just hear that lyric? He said, Got a bag and fixed my teeth. I feel like Cardi B. Remy, I know you're a huge fan of Chance if you're watching this. I love you. I don't want my next album sounding all ushery. Don't be close now. Just keep the shirt now. Honey, we both know that you look better than me. Oh my god. I should tell you guys about what happened yesterday. It's really not a long story at all, so don't worry. Just to give you guys a little backstory, to get into my apartment, you need to go through three sets of doors with keys in order to get in here. So like, if you don't have a key, like there's no way you can get up to my door. So a lot of times, I'm not like afraid to say this, Fab and I like leave the door unlocked if we're both in here. If we leave, we obviously lock it, but if we're both in here, like, like I don't know, sometimes Fab will go to take out the trash and then he'll come back and like, he just forgets to lock it or like there's no real reason to because it's so safe. So last night, it was probably around like, I don't even know, eight o'clock at night and we were sitting on my couch, just the two of us. I was watching Fab play Fortnite. Honestly, I can, I'm getting anxious thinking about it. He always has his headphones in when he plays. So I can hear things that are happening, but he really can't because he's listening to his video game. And I hear my door start to open. Not right now, Gucci, no. <laughs> For some reason, even when I heard the door open, like at first, I just kind of stared at it 
Like, why was I not freaking out? I don't know. And my door opened all the way. And this sweet woman, like she was older. She, and she was like my mom's age. She looked like my mom too. She walked in and she just goes, hi baby. And then she like, I was like, and we made eye contact and we were both like, and she was so embarrassed. Like I felt so bad. I didn't know who was gonna walk through the door. And of course it's like this sweet lady who would never harm anyone. Fab and I were like, okay, we'll probably never see her again. So like, it's no big deal. Cause I felt bad. I was like, oh my God, I feel so bad. She's probably so embarrassed. So then yeah, whatever. I was like, okay, I'll probably never see her again. So it's no big deal. I go out of my apartment to go get a parking pass. And of course I see her. Like the one second that I'm in the hallway for, she is also in the hallway. Long story short, she is my neighbor's mom and she was just visiting. My unit and the unit next to me, we have the same exact layout. I know that because I toured that one too. So like we have literally the same exact apartment. So she just walked in like thinking it was her daughter's apartment. She's got the doors mixed up. But yeah, anyways, I just thought it was really funny, but also scary. <laughs> I'm making it a point like every time I come back to just lock my door because like, I don't need to go through that again. I don't care if they're sweet, like it was too scary. So I'm just gonna finish eating and probably watch some Netflix. Actually, definitely watch some Netflix. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I've never done anything like it. So hopefully it wasn't like too awful. Make sure to subscribe if you guys are new here because I'm posting so much. I'm not gonna give anything away yet because I don't wanna make any promises. You know how I do that. So I don't wanna make any promises yet, but it looks like I'm gonna have a crazy video upload schedule for the next like month and a half. Buckle up and get ready. And I'm just gonna stop talking now because I'm annoying. But yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video very soon.